Hey guys, how you doing? Um, sorry for the delay on the videos. Today I'm gonna give you a preview of the stuff sack from uh, Liverman. Um, you can buy this online at any retailer or e-tailer. Um, I bought it in uh, on Amazon.com. Uh, the only downside of, on this is that you you cannot choose the colors you can only choose the sizes so I believe uh, this is a, a small medium large and extra large and uh, this is what I got a blue one which for me is really fantastic because I uh, blue is one of my favorite colors so as you can see it's uh, kind of big but my sleeping bag is big it's a uh, minus 20 degrees uh, sleeping bag which is an overkill for where I live in uh, upstate California um, in a little town town called Santa Rosa about uh, 40 to 50 minutes from uh, San Francisco so you know it has a little handle over here which is really good we'll see how it performs uh, one, one once I'm back backpacking and uh, when I get my backpack I'll show you how it looks in it and why I chose that backpack specifically specifically for uh, so I can fit this uh, I know it's a little overkill for summer but over here it, it sometimes in summer it goes down to I don't know 40 45 so and then I like to sleep warm like really warm I don't know why, I just, that's just me. Okay. So, see here are the sizes. 12 inches by 25. And you can pause if you want to look a little more. I was surprised about this. Uh, 210D coated uh, nylon. I was really surprised. I was. Uh, I thought it was gonna be a little less than that. So this makes it a little stronger than I expected, which is really good for me because it's gonna be on the outside of my backpack. So and uh, here's the the uh, sleeping bag. Uh, nobody's sponsoring this video. It's just me. It's, this is what I chose. And here's what it looks like. Hold on. Just like that. And see the one I got is the one at the bottom. It's 41 inches by 84. Fill weight 7 pounds. Carry weight, let's just go with 10 pounds total. With you know, round it up. And it's a fiance shy, but hey, it still feels like 10 pounds. Obviously, it's not, but you know, you know what I mean. Here's the temperature rating. And I'm also a hunter, so that's why I went with this. And uh, believe me, it really does work when it's cold. I don't know about minus 20 without just the sleeping bag, but it does work, believe me. I, I slept comfortably in this one. So, um, see, here's what I chose. Here's the little mark. And, um, I mean, this is a really nice really nice sleeping pad so I mean can't go wrong with this like I said um, there's some places close to here that uh, you can get my uh, to zero degrees or minus I don't know 10 20 something like that up in the mountains so that's why I chose this because where I go hunting it does snow and uh, like I said I like to uh, sleep a little comfortably warm not to worry about anything else so then again here's the pack that it came in really wonderful uh, um, I'm really glad I, I got it and um, now here's some other stuff that I got in which I'll do a review a little later see the uh, fur rod right over here uh, I haven't got my stuff yet. I'm, I'm still waiting on it. 
I'll, I'll show it to you once I get it. And uh, here's my um, headlamp, which should be enough for when I'm camping. And this one does stay up to 70 hours at its maximum brightness on four triple A's. He weighs 110 grams or like two or three ounces. I can't remember the conversion, but you know, it's not that heavy in my spork. And I got this, I know it's a little short, but uh, I mean, I got it for looks and convenience. A hook that I can use to get something a lid or whatever when I'm cooking, and that way I don't have to burn myself. And it's titanium, so if you're interested, but at Amazon. I I guess I'll uh, see you later. Thanks.